Do you know anyone who suffers from swollen feet? Swollen feet is not a problem itself, but points to a deeper issue. This usually happens when there's a buildup of fluid in the tissue, making them swell. This is known as edema. As the swelling gets worse, it gets more uncomfortable and it may become hard to walk or stand. It can also get more painful, and the feet may be red. Looking for a cure? Here are some things you can try at home to bring the swelling down. Natural home remedies for swollen feet 1 contrast hydrotherapy hydrotherapy is therapy using water to lessen pain and discomfort. For this type of hydrotherapy, you will use both warm and cold water. The warm water will help blood flow and the cold water will bring down the swelling in your feet. 2 massage one of the best cures for swollen feet is a foot massage. This helps aching muscles and gets the blood flowing. It also helps extra fluid drain to bring down swelling. 3. Epsom salt Epsom salt can bring down swelling very fast, while soothing pain too. This is because it has magnesium sulfate which can be soaked up by the skin to help the blood flow and bring down the swelling. It is also helps sore, tired muscles, and can kill foot odor. 4. Ginger Since ginger is a natural diuretic, it brings down the amount of water in the body, and helps treat swollen feet. This is because it lessens the sodium in the body which is a big cause of swelling. 5. Dandelion Dandelion is a great cure for swollen feet. It helps the body absorb extra fluids because of its diuretic quality. It also helps keep track of the sodium level in the body. 6. Exercise Exercising often is important to stop your feet from swelling. Exercise helps blood flow and stops blood from building up in your lower limbs. 7. Magnesium If your body is missing magnesium, that may cause swelling in the feet due to edema. Make sure to eat foods that are full of magnesium to help fight this problem. Subscribe 10 Home Remedies for Swollen Feet Medically Reviewed by Deborah Rose Wilson, Ph.D., MSN, RN, IBC, AHNBC, CHT on May 10, 2018 Written by Jamie Herndon, MS, MPH, MFA If you buy something through a link on this page, we may earn a small commission. How this works Painless swelling of the feet or ankles is common and can happen for a variety of reasons. Causes of swollen feet can include, staying on your feet too long ill-fitting shoes pregnancy lifestyle factors certain medical conditions when fluid accumulates in tissues, it's called edema. While edema usually resolves on its own, there are some home remedies that may reduce the swelling more quickly and increase your own comfort. Here are 10 to try. 1. Drink 8 to 10 glasses of water per day Though it might seem counterintuitive, getting enough fluids actually helps reduce swelling. When your body isn't hydrated enough, it holds on to the fluid it does have. This contributes to swelling. 2. Buy compression socks Compression socks can be found at a drug or grocery store or even bought online. Start with compression socks that are between 12 to 15 mm or 15 to 20 mm of mercury. They come in a variety of weights and compressions, so it might be best to start off with lighter weight socks and then find the kind that provides the most relief. 3. Soak in a cool Epsom salt bath for about 15 to 20 minutes Epsom salt, magnesium sulfate, may not only help with muscle pain. It may also reduce swelling and inflammation. The theory is that Epsom salt draws out toxins and increases relaxation. Just make sure to get Epsom salts marked with the USP designation. This means that it meets standards set forth by the US Food and Drug Administration and is safe to use. 4. Elevate your feet, preferably above your heart. Prop your feet on cushions, pillows, or even things like phone books, when you sleep. If you're looking to reduce foot swelling while pregnant, try elevating your feet several times a day as well. Aim for about 20 minutes at a time, even on an ottoman or a chair. Try to avoid standing for long periods of time and stay off your feet when you can. 5. Get moving. If you sit or stand in one area for a long period of time, like at work, this can lead to swollen feet. Try to move a little bit each hour, even if it's a walk to the break room, a walk around the block at lunch, flexing your knees and ankles, or a lap around the office. 6. Magnesium supplements can be helpful for some people if you retain water, you might have a magnesium deficiency. Eating foods high in magnesium can help. Magnesium-rich foods to add to your diet include, 
Almonds tofu cashew spinach dark chocolate broccoli avocados taking 200 to 400 milligrams of magnesium daily might help with the swelling. But before you take any kind of supplement, ask your doctor. Magnesium supplements aren't right for everyone, especially if you have a kidney or heart condition. 8. Drink 8 to 10 glasses of water per day though it might seem counterintuitive, getting enough fluids actually helps reduce swelling. When your body isn't hydrated enough, it holds on to the fluid it does have. This contributes to swelling. 9. By compression socks Compression socks can be found at a drug or grocery store or even bought online. Start with compression socks that are between 12 to 15 mm or 15 to 20 mm of mercury. They come in a variety of weights and compressions, so it might be best to start off with lighter weight socks and then find the kind that provides the most relief. 10. Elevate your feet, preferably above your heart prop your feet on cushions, pillows, or even things like phone books, when you sleep. If you're looking to reduce foot swelling while pregnant, try elevating your feet several times a day as well. Aim for about 20 minutes at a time, even on an ottoman or a chair. Here are some other tips to cure swollen feet. Tip number one, elevate your legs so that they are higher than the level of your heart. Tip number two, limit the amount of salt and caffeine you have, because they cause feet to swell. Tip number three, eat fresh fruits and vegetables, instead of canned goods, which have added salt for storage. Tip number four, drink lots of water to keep your body hydrated and clean out bad bacteria. Tip number five, avoid sitting for long hours. Instead, take breaks and walk around a bit. Tip number six, when taking long trips in a car, bus, train, or plane, think about wearing compression stockings to stop feet from swelling.